Welcome to Pause for Prayer. Is there something on your heart? Or something that you would like for us to pray with you about? You may submit your prayer request on our website at holyplacechurch.org. You can also text the keyword that's on the screen to 94,000. Today's verse of the day is Psalm 56 3 KJV What time I am afraid, I will trust in thee. Shall we pray? Father God, sometimes this life seems dark, difficult, and full of despair. Father, we ask you to answer the question today of those who are wondering, why are they here in the earth? Father, in these trying times, when someone wants to give up, answer their question today of what's the point of living? Father, for someone, life seems empty and futile. Help someone today to know that not only do you understand, but that you are working all things out for their good. Give someone to understand today the purpose that you have for their life, that they not be sidelined, but the tricks and tactics of the enemy. In Jesus' name, give us to understand how the pain from our circumstances and situations drive us to make significant changes. Give us to understand that you are calling us to make significant changes that we might be effective in this generation. Father, give us to understand the why so that we can endure the how. The why is our purpose. Strengthen us where we are weak. Bind every hindrance and distraction that causes us to lose our sense of purpose. Father, touch the one today that is wondering if their life means anything. Help them not to lose hope in the future because nothing in their life right now seems to be worth living for. Give us not to be fearful of the changes that you are making in our lives, that we not hide behind excuses or procrastination that keeps us from reaching our full potential in you. Help us to see us to see ourselves as we really are, not as we perceive ourselves to be. Help us not to wallow in guilt or be stuck in despair because of our past, but help us to step into our now with a renewed commitment to walk in our purpose. Help us to reflect and assess what we are afraid of right now, that we not be hindered in not one single thing. Give us to take consideration to ourselves and how we have allowed fear to affect our lives, that we change our habits and patterns so that we can move forward in you. Give us to know beyond a shadow of a doubt that you are calling us to live to a life that is full of meaning and hope. Give us to set a guard over our emotions, that fear not produce an automatic negative response in us. Help us not to take in negative information, that we not be paralyzed by the things people try to do to control a situation. Help us to seek you in all things, that our emotions not lead us astray. Father, if we have fear in any area of our lives, we ask you to replace it with faith, that we put our focus back on you and not our circumstances. In Jesus' name, Father, shift our eyes away from the things that make us afraid, cause us to be consumed by the power of you, our God. We ask that the power of the Holy Ghost that's on the inside of us, that have the fullness of your power, take away all of our fears. Father, many of us are in the middle of a frightening situation. Send strength now. Yes, we know that you are all-powerful. We know that you are well able to protect us, but we need you to help us where there is a disconnect between knowledge and our emotion. Father, we realize that fear is not of you. Give us courage today in the midst of our fear that we might accomplish that which you have set out for us before you call us home. In Jesus' name, amen. We would like to thank you for your faithful listening support because of viewers and listeners like you. The door was opened for us to stream to Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and Twitch. Because of your faithful listening support, prayer is also now available on iTunes, iHeartRadio, Amazon Podcasts, just to name a few. Thank you for your faithfulness in sharing pause for prayer with others. Have an awesome day.